Welcome back to the channel. My name is Thomas Fletcher and I'm the host of the LCSW Network. If you're new to this channel, please do me a favor by smashing that like button, by subscribing to the channel, and by sharing this video with your social work colleagues and friends. The purpose of this channel is to create a community of hope and support where social workers can come for relevant news, information, and inspiration. Well, welcome back to Self Care Saturday. Welcome back to Season 3, Episode 6 of our Self Care Saturday series. How are you guys doing? I don't know about you guys, but I get tired. I get tired. And uh, yesterday, I gave myself a day of rest. I gave myself a day of rest. Because I don't know about most of you, I'm a workaholic. Even though I talk about self-care, I'm a workaholic. And I think that's why self-care is so important to me. Because I'm not just talking about it from an academic point of view. I'm talking about it as somebody who pushes himself, pushes himself day in and day out um, in all areas of my life. Work, family, home. Uh, when I'm when I'm a student, I push myself uh, even uh, even to take care of this YouTube channel, these two YouTube channels. I push myself to uh, make content, put content out here that's useful, that's inspirational. Um, but sometimes we just have to stop and rest. Sometimes and, and sometimes I have to remind myself that it's not being lazy to just stop. Stop being a human doing. Sometimes we have to remind ourselves we are human beings. You know, we don't have to be productive every single day. And, you know, we push ourselves, whether we're social workers, psychologists, psychiatrists, marriage, family therapists. You know, we push ourselves, whether we're in private practice, whether we're working for a governmental agency, whether we're working in, in schools. We're, we're trying to be so productive. We're trying to um, provide services to as many clients as we can. And that's a good thing, especially, you know, this past two years, we, we've lived through this global pandemic and people are stressed out beyond belief, you know, which means our, our caseloads, our panels have gone up. You know, many of us are not just working 40 hours anymore. Many of us are working 50 hours, 60 hours, 70 hours, 80 hours. <clears throat> you know, I, and I think it's really common. My brother, he's not a social worker, but, you know, we chatted yesterday. And he was sharing with me that he worked 90 hours. He's a lawyer. He's an attorney. Shout out to Sean. And I think this is a common occurrence because... Uh, with the expansion of remote working, teleworking, you know, it's very common now that people are working long past 40 hours a week, you know, and I think that's a, you know, I think almost the new normal is that you feel stigmatized if you're not working more than 40 hours. And again, you know, our society, not just mental health professionals, but our society in general has been experiencing the, the effects of burnout over the last two years. You know, I mean, the, the pandemic has heightened it. We've always had burnout in our society, especially American society, um, because we don't, we don't support the way the Europeans do and other societies. We don't support uh, the importance of, of taking four or five, six weeks for vacation. That's almost stigmatized in this society. It really is. You're 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 looked at. You're looked at by your coworkers as a, as a slacker. You know, if you if you take more than a week or two weeks for vacation in, in our society, and you know that, and then we wonder why people burn out. <laughs> so my message for all of us is to stop, stop doing, and and take some time to be, whether that's to rest, whether that's to relax, whether that's just to. You know, take, you know, take some time, you know, away from your work, away from your obligations, just to rest, just to be, whether that's to meditate, whether that's to pray, you know, just stop. We all need to stop and be. 
reflect, right? That's my message for today, for our self-care series, to stop, rest, reflect. All right, I'm gonna stop there, but I wanna thank you all for watching this video. For all the social workers and other licensed mental health professionals, thank you for the work that you do every day for your clients, for your agency, and for the profession. Please continue to support each other and yourselves. Bye for now.